Sagittarius, how are you? This is your weekend reading. It's for anyone with Sagittarius in your chart. And um, it is divinely timed. So whenever you watch the video is fine. Thank you for subscribing. Thanks for giving the video a thumbs up. Uh, because it does help it reach more people. So we're going to go into the energy, see what message we get for Sagittarius. Spirit, please show us what is happening for Sagittarius around the weekend or whenever you watch this video. <laughs> Exercise. <laughs> Run, walk, swim or otherwise move your body. This will give you more energy and happiness. <laughs> and funnily enough, at a mantra that was coming into my mind earlier today was um, positive mind, positive body, you know, because it's the years of pain body um, and negative mind activity in the ego that actually ends up manifesting and putting us into bad health, physical, bad physical health. So obviously it can be karmic as well. Don't get me wrong. I know that from past lives, but, you know, positive mind, positive body and and staying in that vibration so interesting card um let's see uh what else we're getting fairy energy you can see gilbert down there <laughs> it's funny when he sits down there when i'm recording he wants to be seen uh undressing of a salad mm, okay so something here needs to be deconstructed i don't know if it's something to do with your health and you need to break it down in order to you know break down what you've been doing or um, break down negative mind activity about it in order for it to rebuild up in a much more positive way. Um, it might not be to do with your health, but there's something in your life that where you just need to um, deconstruct things so that you can build it up in a more positive, better way. Okay, let's have a look what else we get. So, Eight of Pentacles, you've been working very hard. Um, this is hard work. Now, to the point that you will become an expert at what you're doing here, okay? Now, it doesn't have to be to do with, you know, regular work. It could be any anything to do with your life purpose or anything you've been passionate about that you've been working really hard at. It could even be a relationship. But it's like you sort of become an expert at it because you're just putting so much good work in. Now, you have been through a lot of battles lately. And this weekend, Spirit is saying, look, you are on the final battle at the moment, right? You're on the final big battle before you have this big breakthrough. So keep the same approach. Keep doing what you're doing because you're on the right track. And um, you've got here the Ace of Wands, okay? So somebody offering you a new opportunity which will grow um, it could be a relationship it could be related to your life purpose and it's something you're passionate about and it is going to grow this is the beginning of something very very good for you this weekend okay so interesting let's see what's going on for your person Okay, so you're connecting here to somebody who's very abundant, who's got a very positive energy. Um, they are, they have everything to hand, really. They've got money, they've got connections, um, they've got good skills. They're very grateful for what they've, they've got. Um, you know, they could even be capable of a very good relationship. They may feel lonely at times. OK, um, so somehow they are linked to you and um, sort of life is becoming more positive for you um, imminently, really. Uh, you really are, you know, Tarot is really saying you've just got to keep pushing forward at the moment and keep the same approach you've been taking because, you know, you're really on the verge of a breakthrough here with that Ace of Wands. Um, and um, this person you're connected to, they're in a very good position. So you're quite a good match, whether it be for work. Um, you know, it could be somebody that could help you with your health or, or it, it could be, um, you know, a potential lover. But whoever they are, uh, they're a good match for you and um, they could be beneficial to you. Um, now, this person actually says, I feel insecure. 
So that's interesting, isn't it? Because <laughs> they don't look insecure. But I did say that they could be lonely at times. So, Okay, let's see what your um, spirit guides are saying. Oh, water dragon. Okay. Helps you flow easily around obstacles. Um, Christ's light and love are flowing. Develop your psychic abilities and go with the flow. So, like Spirit said already, keep the same approach because you're on this sort of last battle, if you like, before you enter a whole new timeline. And um, Spirit is basically supporting you, your Spirit Guide is supporting you to uh, remove obstacles, you know, to flow around obstacles. And um, so I feel this weekend's going to go better than you expect. Um, and you're going to come out of it knowing that you ha are very close or even receiving some kind of really good opportunity. OK, um, so and, and like I said, it could be related to work, health, money. Or a relationship. Um, so your spirit guides are encouraging you. To just stay high vibe and go with the flow because you're on the verge of something big here so that's the message uh thank you for subscribing thanks for uh, giving the video a thumbs up and if you want to book in do contact me peace